South Yorkshire Police and Sheffield Wednesday have launched an investigation after a fan was spotted holding up a picture of late Sunderland supporter Bradley Lowry during a championship match at Hillsborough on Friday evening. Lowry, who was diagnosed with neuroblastoma, a rare type of cancer, when he was 18 months old, passed away in 2017 at the age of six. He captured the hearts of the nation with his bravery and his friendship with former Sunderland striker Jermaine Defoe. The home fan was seen displaying a zoomed-in image of Lowry and Sunderland kid on his phone. While another fan looked amused by the act, the image circulated on X formerly Twitter, sparking outrage and condemnation from both sets of supporters and the wider public. A Sheffield Wednesday spokesperson told Mail Sport, We are aware of the images circulating and have launched an immediate investigation together with South Yorkshire Police. We roundly condemn this completely outrageous and utterly deplorable behavior. We can only apologize for the undoubted distress caused to Bradley's family and friends. The behavior of the two fans could have serious consequences for both the men and their club. Ranging from banning orders, to fines, to criminal charges, this is not the first time that Sheffield Wednesday fans have been involved in disorder. At football matches, in February, police released an image of a man they wanted to speak to about trouble that broke out at the turnstiles on Leppings Lane at Hillsborough prior to the start of a match against Plymouth Argyle. In 2020, there was also concern about South Yorkshire police's methods at matches following an incident where an officer struck a 16-year-old supporter over the head with a baton after an away derby against Barnsley. Bradley Lowry's legacy lives on through the Bradley Lowry Foundation, a charity set out by his mother Gemma to support other children with cancer and their families. The foundation has raised millions of pounds for various causes and campaigns, including research into neuroblastoma and other childhood cancers.